So there's Michael. We're doing, we're not do, officially doing a podcast because if I showed you what Nisha's doing and how she looks right now, <laughs> I think she'd kill me. Oops. <laughs> how you doing? I am soaking up, I'm soaking up minerals from mud and I'm releasing impurities. Does, yeah. Does that work? Yeah. Do I look, do I look good? You look, you look lovely. Yeah. You look absolutely radiant. <laughs> So tell me a little bit about what you, what you do. What's the process here? Okay, well, if you look over there, the, where Michael is, there's a cold plunge and a hot plunge. There's the cold, there's right, the hot. So you do the cold and the hot plunge first, and then you take a shower, and then you go steam. So there's a eucalyptus steam shower in there, which is awesome. And then you apply mud to your whole body. This is a mud that has lots of minerals. Let in me it. go show them the mud. I'll be right okay, back. Okay, you All go right. show them the mud. You keep thinking what you're going to do. All right, so this is the cold over there, and it's it's cold. And then this is hot. It's three degrees cooler than the surface temperature of the sun. It's hot. Then here's the shower she's talking about. But this is in the uh, here eucalyptus room. There's your uh, okay. Okay. up. There we go. There's your steam room. Not like you've never seen a steam room, but there's your steam room. But here's the interesting thing. These are pots of mud, and it's warm mud. And uh, I forgot to put the lid back on, but it's like literally like that. And then you, it's, uh, it's thick. And you put it all over your body, and then you get, you're supposed to wait. So we're waiting right now. I'm not a big fan of the uh, of the mud feeling. Well, but that's me. Well, I'm washing my hands. All right. Are you a fan of the uh, of the mud feeling, Misha? I like the mud feeling. It's, yeah. You're supposed to let it dry on you, right? Yeah. So here, you're pretty close. Here's the deal. Um, I was thinking about all the things that that we do for ourselves. You know, we we want to have good energy, and we want to have. We want to have um, no pain in our body, and we want to have good mental clarity. We want all do all those things, but we don't do things to our body to help that along, right? We we don't always eat well. We don't get good sleep. Um, <clears throat> we have a tendency to drink too much caffeine in the morning, drink too much alcohol at night, whatever it might be. I'm, I feel sugar. like I'm describing my life. No, so <laughs> too much sugar, <laughs> too much sugar, too many foods that cause inflammation in our body, and we don't do stuff like this. Wow, it's really drying on me. Yeah. So. This is all about just incorporating things back into your life that, that create a better energy flow. And some of those things are, I can't even imagine what I look like right now. Some of those things are, you know, eating clean, having, <laughs> stop that, <laughs> eating clean and, and starting your day the right way, stretch your body, meditate, even if it's for five or 10 minutes, just to clear your mind and set your intentions for the day. Can I ask and, you a question? Yes. Okay, so they wanted us to do yoga in the morning. It wasn't required, so I did not attend. And right. you yelled at me this morning. Yes. Why is yoga important? It's just like stretching and stuff, well, right? Well, Michael and I did the yoga this morning, and you know, one of the things <laughs> you got to stretch. Your body can't we get well if you don't stretch. Yeah, I'm the we, least flexible person on the planet. I haven't done yoga. I, I used to be so good about doing it all the time, and I haven't done it for a while. And I just realized how important yoga is to strengthen and lengthen your muscles. And I was really tight in my shoulders. You were you were tight in your hips. So it's just, it's something I gotta get back to. So this is a great way to reset. And I think even if you just try to do one thing that improves your energy flow a week, it could be just like, I'm dedicating myself to getting better sleep at night, or I'm dedicating myself to incorporating some 10 minutes of meditation or breathing exercises, whatever breathing. it might be. But doing something like this is fun because it, it's, it's a good way to get the minerals in and get the toxins out, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is that it? That's it. Well, okay. unless you want to add something. Yeah, subscribe to the Nisha Jackson Show. Hit the subscribe button right there. It's right there. Hit the subscribe yeah. button. And go and have a spa day. And what? And have, have a spa day. Have you, a spa day. You can order this stuff and do this at home. You, mm. you, could, you could steam in your shower. You know, you can take a shower, get your pores open, apply the mud, and go sit outside in the sun. Or sit out, sit out somewhere outside, you know, on a, on a towel or something, so you don't get everything messy. It is let, messy, and let it dry. You can do this at home. You don't have to go to a spa. 
There's a good salt bath uh, you can get from uh, Israel called Ahava. That would be yes, good. Yes, I love Dead that one. Salt, so. Actually, that, they have a salt and a mud. Mm -hmm. Ahava, yeah. There you go. Okay, thank All you very right. much. We'll catch you next time. Go uh, check out NishaJackson.com <laughs> and uh, check and subscribe. And we'll see you next time here with the Nisha and the Ghost <laughs> show. <laughs>